All right, so I'm going to jump right into these questions. The first unlimited fan Q&A question is from Rachel from Orlando. What were your thoughts on what happened after the Connor and Khabib fight? And we'll just go down. Al, we'll start with you. You, you. you know those guys. I loved it. That was great. There you go. Yeah. Honestly, if you're going to be mad at somebody, you stay mad at them. That's it. That's he, your style. He, he, wanted, he wanted some more. He didn't. You know, Connor talked a lot. It, yeah. You can't just have, you know, you got to take a little bit more, you know, a little neck crank, a little <laughs> more, you know, you got to, you, you can't just, I don't know. Oh, uh, you, you're earning that nickname, Rage and I like, which I love it. I love it. Can I answer one? All right. Sure. Well, I'm not really asking. I'm not really <laughs> Well, asking. I thought we were all going to, okay. Oh, do we? Oh, I don't oh, know. You go throw, throw that, that question out. We can throw that question right, right out. Right, buddy. That's a good you, question. It's a good question. Do you think that Lewis improved on his cardio for this fight? Is Timothy from Houston? Eh. Uh, Derek, no. I just, no. no. All right. No. What, what, I, what I will I think, tell you. Yeah. I don't think he has the, like, motivation to, like. <laughs> what, what I will tell you is that he never quit training for between fights. So he got in Good. pretty decent shape. He realized, and he, you know, was right back at it. He, uh, and, you know, he's had back problems in the past. He's lost a little weight. Hopefully that's helping with his back, or he said it is. So, you know, he has actually been training straight since his last fight. That could, could that be a good thing and a bad thing, you think? It, no. So no? you'd think that. Yeah, yeah. I'm not trying to sound like a jerk, but Derek Lewis don't overtrain. <laughs> 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 it could be a bad thing if you're really training too hard. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't see that, that happen. <laughs> but he ain't overtraining. He's just steady and consistent. He just needs to be consistent. I got one. You guys are good. It's for Wonder balls. Boy. Oh, oh, oh. Who do you think your next fight will be from Jonathan Medina? That's a good question. Um, in my last fight, everybody knows I ended up tearing my NCL. Um, so I was out for a while, and I understood that uh, – um, you know, uh, Robbie Lawler came off a knee injury as well. You know, yeah. he's ranked number five. I'm, the, uh, uh, I'm number four. So I've been trying to fight this guy. I've been wanting to fight this guy for a while since he was the champion. So Robbie, hopefully we'll make that happen. the call, Robbie. Let's go. Yeah. Let's yeah. go. I, man, I've been wanting That's to great. kind of fight Robbie Lawler since 2004. <laughs> like, he used to he, fight at 185, right? I remember. I remember. Well, I remember like fighting on cards and being like, that is a bad dude. He don't care. So, uh -uh. Old, old school story about Robbie Lawler. I, we were talking to him at Militich. Was, me and Roy went up there and trained with him, and they were like, how does he warm up? And they were like, oh, he just watches some Mike Tyson highlight videos in the locker room. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> he don't really warm up. This is back, you know, 2005 and six, and I was like, okay, that's awesome. <laughs> Man, I remember watching He just watches his highlight videos. He's got an awesome highlight video. Yeah. I no, forgot he, the guy he fought, but he was getting crushed by leg kicks. Melvin Man. Oh, oh man that's heart. right. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. That was a sick knockout. Yeah, well, he, he touches you, so good luck with that. Good luck for that. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Who's, who's got the next question? We're, we're on there's the phone. Lots so of, there's lots so of good questions. questions. Well, there's one for you here, Cody, about uh, about uh, dropping to 125. I'm looking. I'm getting so many questions on right, here. Dropping to 125. It was uh, from Missy. From Missy. No, I, I lied. It's not from Missy. Dropping to 125. I would like to do that. Um, you want to do I would like that. to get some. You know, get back top of my division, get my title, and then go back to the, uh, you know, if if it's possible, if the UFC still, I know there's rumors that the UFC flyweight division might be done. To spend? I don't no, know. No, it's not happening. But so, yeah, if I stay, you know, stay at 35, I obviously want to get my title back, get back to the top of that division. Well, you just had a kid, too, so you probably got a little extra baby weight. So you I don't. I lost weight. <laughs> really? Yeah. The During the pregnancy? Okay. Yeah. The, mess, the, the breast milk kept me lean. <laughs> <laughs> The finest breast well, That's awesome. I'm sorry. Um, all right. Question for you. If Weidman wins tonight, you, Stephen Wonderboy Thompson, Weidman wins tonight, who should he fight next? You know, he 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 beat Gaslam in Gaslam's fight for the title. So I think that after this, we'll put him up for a title shot after this. I think he should he should be going for it. I know Luke's injured. and He'll be out for a while. Yeah, so, so, yeah. you know, put him up there. I think he deserves it. Yeah, I'm with that. Oh, that sounds reasonable. Uh, I'm with that unless um, they decide to get one. Uh, uh, no. Yeah, well, Romero or um, Asanya. Asanya, yeah, because he went 15-0. I mean, yeah. he's fresh blood. Just think about it yeah, that yeah. way. You know okay. what I mean? Like he's. he's but, you know, I, and I'm just from from the other side. Oh, is that that guy saying, oh, wait, what? The cutest. 
Oh no, that is oh, cute. Yeah. That you but no. Listen, here's the deal with I've the blanket. I saw the blanket. Time, not I saw free. the guys. Yeah. Hands above Shivering. the blanket. Please. <laughs> yeah, hands yeah. above the blanket. High school <laughs> teacher. And high school teacher jumping out. So yeah. I tr I tried not to like. I noticed that, and then I was like, oh, y'all didn't even like screw me. She, you know, that's like. No, I, where, I, Where's the? Uh, you guys aren't gentlemen. You're like. I did we'll, it when we'll keep it. there was a law in action, so no one actually saw me get. No, no, it was good. It was slick. And then he looked at me like. You gonna give me some of that, Dude, bro? I'm freezing. Like, I'm trying not to shiver right now. So I'm, I'm really trying I'm to. I'm good. I, I have, my, I I have my UFC 205 leather what, jacket on, yeah. so I'm like, I'm cozy. My my additional body hair keeps me plenty warm. That's amazing. <laughs> I just shaved, so it's gone. I, I, I've got one. I've got one from Forrest right here. Thank you. Yes. Who is your favorite fighter to watch in the lightweight division currently? From Missy Marie from New York. Allowed, lightweight. Are you allowed? To oh. Play? Well, Al is actually no. Al is one of my favorites. The other guy that's <coughs> that's caught my eye, obviously, um, <clears throat> what's the name? Justin Gaethje. He's fun. And then um, uh, you, let, you let guys with style like you. I, well, I like guys that fight. I like people yeah. that fight. You fight, so I like right. you. There you go. Take it. Yeah. I fight. What about girls that fight? I like women that yeah. fight. It's, it's <laughs> good. It's cool. I like people that fight. Yeah, like so people. next question to you, uh, Misha, who do you have between Cyborg and Amanda Nunez? Mm. I was impressed a little late talking trash, both of them in a foreign language yesterday. Right. you got to yeah. take that into consideration when Three you see subtitles. two Portuguese pe or Brazilians. That this is their second language, man. Yes, I will say firsthand that Amanda hits incredibly hard. You know, she's very powerful. She hits like a man. But um, with that being said, you know, she's undersized, and, and Cyborg is the woman to beat. Uh, there's nobody that has given her real trouble yet. Um, so we'll see. You know, I do think that, uh, that Cyborg has to adjust her game plan a little bit in the sense that she can't just run forward and run into the punches of Amanda because she hits hard enough to hurt Cyborg. She's hard enough to hurt, hit, hurt a lot of people. Um, but with that being said, of course, I'm going to I'm pick Cyborg. I, I believe that too. And then it's, I believe exactly what you said there. Sometimes Cyborg gets away with being the bigger batter yeah. and she takes shots Almost and always. just walks through them to land bigger shots. Um, I thought Holly Holm did a pretty good job. Great job. So, sometimes she landed some good shots on her. But um, I do think Amanda hits harder than punch Holly wise Holm. Than right. Holly Holm. Exactly. That's Holly's more about her kicks. You know, exactly. she's very powerful there. So, so no. we agree. This is that. That's twice. I think that's twice. twice. You know. You know what it other, is. I tell you what. You know what it is. <laughs> I I learned my lesson the last time you were on this show, and I was like, man, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go along with start the agreeing. Working. Everything. Yeah, just <laughs> you just learn to agree. Yeah. I was like, you figure I'd know that I'm married. I'm married I know, forever. Right? I want you again. Um. Yes. So <laughs> this next question is for you, Al. You have a rematch with. Kevin Gast or Kevin Lee in December. Um, that fight was a few years ago. Before you tell us how you think it will be different, we are going to cut to a couch classic. Uh oh. Yeah, yeah. Let's see. We're we cutting to the couch oh, classic, maybe. I kind of like Ally Quinta for that one. Oh. I, me and him got some unfinished business, so I might go ahead and. Uh, That's a really good match. Hey, happen. you know what? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna that ain't a bad idea. That's a good fight, right? right? <laughs> Where, where's Al at on that? He, you know, have you. Um, well, he just got done right now when you said that. Oh, yeah. He'll be mad to hear oh, that. Uh, is it? Look, look. <laughs> he knows. As soon as he sees me, he'll be mad. We, we he'll got be back. one of those. It's, 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 it's on site. It's on site. As soon as he sees me he walk into the room right now, I got to flip off the headset. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> is he fucking kidding me? Flip off that. He's not doing shit. All right. But you guys are fighting, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah. yeah don't say you flip the headset. Be a professional, Kevin Lee. <laughs> oh, I'm sure. I, you know, God. Come on, Kevin. is my boy. He's, you know, he's going to talk. He's trying yeah, to be he's got a degree in he's, in he's got a degree in biology. Kevin you know Lee? That? Yeah. He's a, I did he's not a, know he's that. He's an educated young man. He's what? Not a, he's not a mumble rapper. <laughs> he, tries, he's, he's, he should just be himself. I think people would like him a lot better if he was himself. <laughs> <laughs> you, could, you could beat the guy up and maybe give him some style points. I like uh, it. I like it. <laughs> um, so, yeah, tell us about that fight, though. How's this fight gonna be different? I think it's uh, hopefully it's not different. Hopefully I yeah. still maybe I finish him this time. But uh, no, he's tough. I um, he's definitely all in on fighting. I, you know, he came into the first fight very cocky. He was it was his first fight in the yeah. UFC. I was still young, third fight I think it was my third, and uh, in the weigh-ins he was like, uh, you know, he's Kevin Lee coming in. He told Dana White, get your checkbook ready. I'm coming to take everything. And then I beat him. And I remember the look on his face after he was very humbled. He was very yeah. head down. Um, so I think he won a few fights. He's back on his high horse. I think it's right, perfect. Just put him right <laughs> in the same spot. It's just gonna happen right again. I think he's tough. He, he, after that fight, he moved to Vegas. He changed his life. You know, he yeah. he realized that 
It's you know, this is the real deal. So he's been I think he's been training for me a lot. He's been thinking about it a lot. After a couple of his fights, he's called me out. Um, now he's ranked higher than me. He's had he's a bunch of great fights. His last fight, I was sitting ringside when he fought Barbosa, and I was like, holy shit, Kevin Lee beat the crap out of Barbosa. That was a good fight. Actually. That was, yeah, 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 it was a really good fight. I mean, for Kevin Lee, it was definitely a really good fight. <laughs> I mean, Bar and Barbosa's tough. You know, you know how tough that guy is. So yeah. for it, it shows how far Kevin Lee's come. He's uh, he's definitely uh, he's definitely tough, and I got my work cut out for me. But I'm uh, yeah. I'm yeah, I'm ready to go. I'm I'm gonna enjoy this fight. Well, sounds good, man. Sounds yeah. good. What else? Anybody else questions? Do you see questions on this for you? Anybody? Uh, for for us. For uh, you specifically. Really. Yeah. No. <coughs> what about uh, Wonder Boy? How do you feel about Ben Askren fighting? Askren, yeah, he's about to say that's yeah. Nick from Louisiana. Askren's a tough age. dude. So man. I gotta, oh I gotta goodness. ask. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit, uh, I'm gonna hit Askren up on Twitter right after this. I don't really know that much about. Him. Does he always talk this much? Uh, Is this like a thing? I don't, I don't know. I have no <laughs> I idea. But he's we're finding out. It's funny because uh, I, I was lot tagged. To say. I was tagged in a, uh, a post, and he's already got his hit list, and I'm on, I'm on the hit list, man. It's actually a list yes, of yeah. people. I don't know if you saw it or not, but I'm no, on No, but there. I remember, like, Billy Madison when he calls the guy, and the guy <laughs> had, like, the list, and he's like, I'm okay, sorry. I'll take your name off. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, Ben Askren's a tough guy. You know, uh, very, you know, I think one of the best wrestlers in the division for sure. Um, you know, uh, so, yeah, he's calling everybody out right now. I think he's going to be forced to be reckoned with in this division. So, sure. you know, I've got my hands cut out for me. I'm going to be training for it. And I know most of the guys that I fight are going to want to take me down, and, but he's one of the best. So, well, yeah, I mean, you know. You, you kind of train with some pretty good wrestlers. I do. Though, day I do. in, day out. So I wouldn't, you know. I don't even know if that would be my game plan against you anymore. I see a lot of people, like, try and take you down, and then they just get tired, and then you punch and kick them, and they're like, man, I really wasted all my energy trying, trying to, to take, take them him down. down. And you just pop right back tiring. up. It is. The most oh tiring thing to do is try to wrestle something. I remember yeah. when Johnny Hendricks, you know, go, went for the takedown, and when I got back up, I could see it in his face. Like, oh, yeah, yeah. Gosh. Yeah. That's you the know, worst. Oh, yeah. I know. Yeah. yeah. Nice, nice. All right. Next, well, let's find some more questions. What? Metro Prime is the boy. Oh, pr here we go. Breaking news. This just in. <laughs> this just, thank you. <laughs> yes. Uh, Metro by T-Mobile pro Promo. Uh, Forrest Griffin, make a guest fighter read this. Um, Al, I don't think you've done one of these. You Let's go, Al. Oh, Al. Jesus. So you just read those words. <laughs> it, you gotta read? Yes. Just any, you didn't know that? Who's Nobody not brought you to read? We, we did that. What you if know, I can't read? We didn't prep you what at all. What if I can't read? If what you if, really cannot. Well, all right, well what if English here. wasn't all like, right. we're going to get somebody who English isn't it. their first language on here. Yeah, what happens if that, what if I really can't read? I'm I'm actually nervous, more nervous than to, for, to read than to All fight. Right, so <laughs> I, all right, I, I'll do it. I love this guy. I love you. Guest fighter slash individual card in parentheses. <laughs> we want to make in parentheses. They put it. Look at this. They put it. We want to make sure that all of you are watch that all of you watching at home <laughs> know what to do if you want to learn more about new Metro by T-Mobile. Uh, right, keep going. Yep, yep, yeah, yeah. Yep. Sorry. Yep. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All of your questions can be answered by visiting Metro by T-Mobile's website. There you go. There it is. There or it call them. There it is on the screen right, right there. There we go. One of more than 10,000 Metro by T-Mobile stores across the country. What, do, what am I doing with the pillows? All right. The pillow just or by calling Metro by T-Mobile customer care. 